Hello everyone. Today we have with us Shyam, classroom student of Gate Aerospace Academy, who got All India fourth rank in Gate 2020. So Shyam, can we start with your educational background first? Uh, yeah, uh, I did my B.Tech in Aeronautical Engineering from SVIT Vasad. After that, I prepared for Gate for one year, and after that, I joined ISC, and I'm in corporate uh, since last one year. Okay, okay. So how was your experience at Gate Aerospace Academy? Uh, my experience at Gate Aerospace Academy was quite fruitful, I will say. Uh, the learning curve there was like brilliant. I was not, not that good student in my B.Tech. After that, I took study seriously in my drop year and learned everything from you guys and and prepared well. So it helped me a lot in the sense like building my confidence and all. So yeah, it was quite fruitful. So regarding lecture, uh, like many people used to ask us that whether you will start from the basics or not. So what's your view on that? Like uh, all the subjects were taught from the basics? Yeah, absolutely. Like uh, no, nothing was assumed from uh, our side. Like you, uh, this classes will start from the scratch. So uh, you guys will not assume that you will know these things and all. So uh, fundamental things, all the things will be get covered in the, all the classes. Okay, okay. So how many hours you used to study for your gate exam preparations? So actually, I never counted hours, but uh, I had simple rules. Like uh, I will wake up early. And after 9 p.m., uh, I will not study. Like that was the two rules I I, I followed throughout my uh, preparation. So I will wake up around 6:37 and uh, do routine work uh, like till and start uh, studying around 9, 9 and 9:30. So actually, it de it it depends upon person to person, right? Yeah. Uh, so you have to build your own routine. So regarding few points, I was uh, discussing with Mahender too, uh, mm -hmm. Mahender All India third ranker. He was with you in the offline yeah. class. So uh, uh, there were few points which on which we were having discussion like uh, weekly test and silly mistake. So regarding weekly test, so we used to have weekly test after completion of certain topic in offline class, and uh, you yeah. guys used to uh, get the highest mark, you Mahender and all. So uh, for a Gator Space aspirant, how important you consider uh, to those uh, weekly tests which we used to conduct after completion of certain topics so i will say not certain topic you took weekly test or after every topic so <laughs> and weekly tests are like uh, there is no point in preparing like only studying studying and preparing by on yourself like so you have to constantly evaluate yourself by giving test so how you are performing, where you are doing mistakes, and that all things are matter, uh, that matters the most. So yeah, weekly test was the very important pillar of my preparation. So by weekly test, you will know that, OK, in this topic, I understood this part, and I'm making mistakes. And you will also guide that, OK, mm -hmm. you have to do this, you have to prepare well this topic, and these are the uh, resource for that. So yeah, weekly tests were quite important. And how you used to analyze your mistake? Because after attending the test, uh, uh, the most important part of preparation is to analyze our mistake in any test so that we can prepare well. So what was your process of doing that? OK, uh, but in that sense also, I had a rule that I will not spend much time analyzing that. OK, I will go through the paper. Whatever things I have done wrong, I will do that question. And uh, relatively, I will find out relative questions in that topic and uh, do that also. So analyzing, like it's you have to uh, grow, right? You have to filter your mistakes, and that's how you will do it. Analyzing is uh, important. And is there any advice from your side uh, to eliminate those silly mistakes in gate exam? Because even top rank rankers are doing the silly mistake, right? So not top rankers. All the people will do that. I also did myself so many mistakes in uh, gate. Like uh, I still regret. Like uh, it was so basic and. Uh, so I, I will suggest that you have to take uh, five to six marks of margin. Like you will do this kind of silly mistakes okay. and don't cry over them. You consider them. OK, I will do the five to 10 marks mistakes and try to perform better, like increase, like uh, target more. So attend more questions carefully. Okay. So and the silly mistakes, like, uh, if you practice well, chances will decrease of making silly mistakes. That's all. So silly mistake is the like 
you can't avoid it completely you will do little but you can <coughs> filter it out yeah yeah so uh, in those two section that is aptitude general aptitude and aerospace which section you went uh, first uh, aerospace so i was quite confident about the aerospace uh, part so i, I okay in uh, actually uh, after uh, like what i did was uh, uh, finished the major portion of aerospace uh, portion and after that I, I was bored kind of thing so i, I went to aptitude and then come back again to uh, aerospace okay okay does that matter if if someone attempts uh, aero, aerospace engineering first or general aptitude first in my view like uh, if i am stronger at technical part then i will go for aerospace first and then later on aptitude so does that matter i don't think it will matter like uh, after giving so many mock tests uh, everyone will understand their strength and they will figure out their own strategy so they don't have to pick any strategy from anyone else they will figure it out so yeah it doesn't matter i guess okay okay and uh, what was your strategy for revision ha huh. so for revision uh, i used to make short notes like uh, i had my short note and on daily basis i used to revise after some time like uh, and uh, like equations and all i used to revise daily but concept wise like i had marked some uh, some basic examples of every concept like okay if you do this solve this example again uh, your whole concept will get covered so i used to solve that question also after uh, some time interval so uh, it was already pre planned and i will mark it how many times i have revised every topic so and when i have revised so based on that data i will prioritize things so revision strategy was like uh, as you guys also emphasize on uh, revising topics so i was uh, taking care of that from the beginning also so it's not like that you start revision at the end only so you whatever you study you make plan and start revising after one month 15 days like uh, after you cover the topic so the more you revise it more better you uh, can solve the examples okay so so during revision time uh, on any particular day you used to revise uh, just one subject on any particular day or it was a mix uh, mixture of subject like after okay. finishing particular subject uh, then you move to another subject or it was a mixture during revision I, I, i never treated it like a uh, subject right so a uh, topics I, i i used to prioritize okay i will revise these topics from the the subject after that some other subject okay i i believe that mixing uh, subjects will help in exam like you have uh, questions like one question will be from structure another question will be from uh, aerodynamics so uh, like it's not like that uh, okay, you do only structure question in a sequence and then aerodynamics so mixing the revision st- uh, uh, topics in revi- revision also that will help i guess okay okay so how did you remain motivated throughout your preparation and stick to the track because lots of student used to ask this they uh, they used to lose the track in between so i will say that i had no other option now like okay. <laughs> other than studying right so i had no backup plan that, that that's all i i, I got I, i get everything through gate only that was clear very clear that if i want to do well in my career i have to do this so that was the source of motivation for me so uh, whenever i used to feel down like i didn't perform well in test or do so many silly mistakes so i used to talk with uh, friends like pankaj and all so they also used to help me get, get motivated and all okay okay so any advice you you want to give to gate or space aspirant regarding preparation okay stay calm make a schedule and uh, at least join a mock test and i will suggest the the do preparation like uh, rigorous preparation under coaching and guidance that will help them because they, in aerospace it's like cluttered right you don't know what to study so if they are coming to you mm-hmm. you know what to prepare mm-hmm. and that will save a lot of energy so if the things are channelized you don't waste time and focus your energy on growing and learning things otherwise you will find uh, waste so many ta- so much time in finding materials and all only so that's my advice 
ओके ओके सो वुड यू रिकमेंड गेट और स्पेस एकेडमी टू ऑल गेट और स्पेस एस्पिरेंट्स एब्सोल्युटली यस व्हाई नॉट लाइक आई आई लास्ट टाइम समबडी टॉट मी समथिंग विद सो मच पैशन वाज यू गाइस लाइक एट गेट और स्पेस आफ्टर आफ्टर क्लियरिंग गेट इन आईएससी लाइक लाइक you have to learn on yourself nobody will teach you anything so yeah that was the last time somebody taught me anything so absolutely i will recommend a get or space academy to anyone okay thank you so much sham for joining with us all the best for your future thank you thank you sir year after year we consistently produce ranks from our classroom program students at get or space academy we offer get or space classroom program we provide regular and weekend classes in this program in hyderabad bangalore new delhi and chennai we also offer gator space online program students from all over india can enroll in and attend classes in this program we also offer gator space postal program students who wants to self prepare for gator space exam can enroll in this postal program to get all the materials that are needed and we also offer gator space test series program test series are very crucial in the preparation process so make sure that you practice more before the actual exam our test series course is divided into two main categories gate aerospace test series and gate aerospace previous year questions test series this gate aerospace test series is further arranged according to topic wise test for different different topic of a particular subject subject wise test for different subjects then combination of subjects under multiple subject test grant test has full syllabus test like gate exam similarly previous year questions test previous year questions test series are arranged according to topic wise subject wise and then year wise we have also published two must have book for aerospace aspirants that is gate aerospace solution book and gate or space formula book which you can buy from flipkart and amazon there is separate video regarding features of this book link is given in description you can check it for postal program we have problem sheet book level 1 and level 2 and study material for all the subjects vector structure aerodynamics space mechanics jet propulsion flight mechanics engineering mathematics be sure to subscribe to our youtube channel and click on the bell icon if you want to learn more about gate aerospace and receive regular updates about aerospace and aeronautical engineering such as lectures job notifications internships job openings and many more by subscribing to our youtube channel you will be notified whenever we upload a new video and it helps us to reach you quickly join our official telegram channel for regular updates and follow us on social media thank you thank you so much